I was gonna save you. I was gonna save you. All right, this is what happened. I'm saying it. I'm saying it. Look, so I owe George two 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 thousand dollars because of my because of my acting up at the casino. Okay. Two thousand right? pounds. Two thousand pounds, not dollars. Two thousand pounds, right? And you all, all know right. that I had to stay in the UK for a long amount of time because my eardrums were fucked, right? And basically, we couldn't stay at the Airbnb anymore that we're at because, like, it was just like it was like we like our time was over, right? And George is like, "Well, I'm just going home." And I was like, "George, like, I'm sick. My eardrums are like fucked. Like, I can't hear out of one ear. The other one's bleeding blood." So you had to delay like, your flight. You had to delay I did delay. Flight. I did That's delay more. my flight, so I couldn't. I couldn't go home, right? And George is. I'm like, George, let me stay with you. He says no. I can't stay with him, and that I have to get. I have to go get a hotel and just like sit there, and that's where I have to stay, um, because like George didn't want me to stay at his house for whatever reason. And I was like, all right. I was like, well, if you're doing that, I'm not paying you your 2K well, listen, back because well, listen, you're a dick. Because you're, cause you're we, a dick. We both, and I was like, you're not letting me stay knew, at your place. Listen, we both knew that we weren't staying here because I didn't want to stay here with that map. Yeah, but like we didn't, we didn't we, we foresee, rented, we, rented we didn't, somewhere. we we didn't foresee that my eardrums were going to get bursted. I was going to be sick, just like doing nothing. And instead of being a good friend and letting me, I even said, George, I'll just stay on your couch. Like, I don't even like, I'll just stay on your couch. I didn't I, want you bleeding on my couch. Yeah. Well, I was like, and I'm stuck in this country, like, uh, like a country nice. I, I don't <laughs> Your hotel live is nice. In. What are you complaining about? Well, I'm deducting the 2K I owed you because you were a, a horrible friend. It's not horrible. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Dream even agreed that you were being a bad friend. Okay. Well, no, you did. Dream did agree. <clears throat> All right, my perspective Dream, on the Dream situation said, Dream is says that. that the flight was delayed, and then and then George should have let you stay at his place probably, but it is his choice. But then you're you were like stuck. What I felt bad about was that you were stuck in the UK. You couldn't go home because you couldn't fly because your eardrums were like so messed up and like the pressure from the flight would like make it. So you had to, you were spending so much money like every day on like a hotel and then also like and then you because you had to do that you 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 chose to make your flight like closer which you also had to pay like a premium for and then on top of that you didn't like you like you were like sleeping all day and you couldn't like do anything <clears throat> and I was saying like if I was there I would have like st I would have at the very least like stayed with you to like like help you and like buy like get you food and like make sure you're okay and that's what i said i said that i said <clears throat> that i thought it was a little fucked up that george didn't do that um and then and then george was like well i didn't have an obligation to do that <laughs> yeah and so i was like all right if you're gonna be a dick i'm not paying you back and, but then uh, to be fair what did i say seven what did i say about that well you said well, you should be a man of your word, or you uh, should always honor your word. I said, word, so you should pay him back. But you said, you said that true. George should should probably be a good friend and be like, all right, I'll call it even and agree to it, which he wouldn't. That is, that's not what I said, actually. You said something like that. No, I said that I wouldn't have been in that situation because I wouldn't have done what George did. <laughs> that's what I said. But I said that I said that if I were you, I would pay it back because I said that if you if you say you're gonna pay someone money, you, then the, you owe that person that money. Like there's no reason you shouldn't pay them, even if I like, give a disagreement or there's anything that you should just pay them. But I did say that uh, it, like it makes sense that you'd be mad at him because <laughs> he cost you a lot more than what you owed. Yeah, he him. cost me mo way more than what I owed him. So I was like, all right, I'm deducting that out of what I owe you. <laughs> Yeah. Because, like, I wasn't even being unreasonable. I was like, George, I'll just stay on the couch. Like, I won't even bother you. Like, I'll just literally be on the couch, like, all day, sleeping all day. I'll wake like, up occasionally. Letting his feeling out now. Order like, some food. George, and he wouldn't, he wouldn't even let me do therapy. that. So I was like, so Guys, I was like this all is right, therapy. George, you. you're not getting your money back. I said, be quiet. Come on, George, talk to me. <laughs> Come on, speak your, speak your truth and your feelings, George. <laughs> <laughs> George, come on. Look, this is a therapy session. How do you feel about Safnap? Sure. Say it. I wish you. I wish you would. Wait, did he say something in the chat? Yeah, I'm telling you, George, <laughs> that goes way worse for you than it does for me. <laughs> like so much worse. How do you feel about Safnap, George? George, just speak your truth on how you feel about Safnap. Come on. <laughs>
<laughs> um, I dumb. I tried saving you, George. I would have saved you, but you didn't let me save you. You tried to cut me off. You, what I would have said was so much better than what Safnav said. <laughs> You're so dumb. And also hearing it from like someone, hearing it from someone being like, "Yeah, he was a bad friend to me," versus like a neutral party talking about it is is way better. <laughs> Look, all I know is I, I would not have you. done that to George. That's all I know. What I know is you're crying about having to stay in a nice hotel. It wasn't a big deal. It was a big deal to me. No. Look at this. How about this? Maybe we should look look in the chat, boys. <laughs> Maybe we should talk about this. <laughs> 